Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel and today we are discussing one public notice that is coming from Tripura Public Service Commission and we have vacancies in the post of scientific officer. Okay, so in today's video we are going to discuss this whole notification, all the details, eligibility criteria, salary, different disciplines where we have vacancies. Okay, so it is as I said that it is coming from Tripura Public Service Commission. So it is an online application which is invited from the bona fide citizens of India. Okay, so if you are an Indian citizen, you can apply for this post. Okay, it's not like that that if you if you belong from the Tripura, then only you can fill this form. If you are an Indian citizen, then you can fill the application form. And we have total five vacancies. Two vacancies are unreserved and other three are reserved. Okay. And this is temporary. Okay. This is temporary. Okay. So it is, it is for the post of scientific officer. It is for the post of scientific officer group B. Okay. And the salary will be around the pay scale will be 47,600. Okay, that is level 13 of Tripura state and pay matrix will be 2018 pre-reserved pay band. Okay, the grade pay will be 4,800 and it will come under department of uh, home department of government of Tripura. Okay, so this is few important informations about this post. So this is for scientific officers post. We have total five. Um, we have total five posts okay two reserved and three unreserved and we have three different sections okay so scientific officers post scientific officers post in the department of chemistry chemistry division or we call it toxicology division if you are from forensic background you guys know that what toxicology is so the first vacancy which is coming from this notification is from the department of chemistry okay from the department of like it is the post of scientific officer and in that scientific officer in the department or division of chemistry or toxicology division here we have two vacancies one unreserved and one reserved okay if you are from other state okay this is one important information if you belong like if you are from other state of india then you have to fill this form as unreserved okay because you need to have reservation under state government of Tripura then only you can like fill the form as a reserve candidate okay next post is scientific officers post in the biological sciences okay so biology serology which includes DNA typing division or you can say biology serology division DNA typing division again here we have two posts one unreserved and one is reserved then we have scientific officers post in the department of physics ballistics and document division only one post and that is completely reserved okay so this is the description of different divisions and posts so post is simply scientific officer and you have different divisions in here okay so next we will look into educational qualification so in educational qualification we can say the essential qualification is for chemical science division okay here we will talk specifically on the basis of department so first is chemical science division as i said chemical division or uh, toxicology division so you need to have minimum like you need to have msc with 50 percent marks in chemistry like chemistry need to be one of your uh, one of your subject i'm saying suspect i don't know why okay so one subject should be chemistry biochemistry or forensic science if you have any one subject from the following you are eligible to like apply in the chemistry division okay then we have okay you have you need to have msc with 50 percent marks from the recognized university then in biological division so in biological division again you need msc with 50 percent of marks you have to have subjects like botany zoology microbiology biotechnology biochemistry physical anthropology or forensic science okay every every person who all like like the people who have botany zoology microbiology biotechnology biochemistry physical anthropology and forensic science 
okay genetics with botany zoology or any other subjects from the recognized university are eligible for this post third division is your physical division so again msc with 50% marks the subjects will be physics mathematics forensic science with physics so in in forensic science you need to have forensic physics in the uh, course then you are eligible for this post okay the desirable qualification i'll star mark it here okay so you need to have knowledge it is an additional qualification it's not mandatory but it will be good if you know bengali like little bit knowledge of bengali and the local language of tripura okay bengali why bengali because like, bengali people they are like they live there that's why probably i don't know okay now talking about age limit so age limit is minimum is 18 and maximum is 14 if you are 18 years old then you are eligible like not below 18 years and not above 40 years so these people can fill the form okay okay so the starting date okay wait a minute you when you can fill the form okay i'll let you know because it will be there in the notice again selection procedure so we have a written exam of 180 marks 180 marks a written exam it will be mcq multiple multiple choice questions on the omr sheet so it is not an online examination you have to fill the omr sheet you have to fill the omr sheet it looks something like this and we have to fill the correct answer like that so you have two sections again so first section one will be the common for all the um, aspirants and it contains 60 marks you have to give this uh, like section you have to invest your one hour in this then you have subject matter that will be different if you are applying for biology different biology division it will be different if you are applying for physics it will be different the subject matter the syllabus will be different and the questions will be different and that subject matter will have 120 marks and you have to and you have to solve these question in 2 hours then you have interview interview it will it will contain 20 marks so 20 marks for interview okay so a limited number of candidates like maximum 5 times of a total post will be selected on the merit wise okay so on the base of merit you will be you will be called for interview okay then again we have exam scheme so scheme of examination will be the item number 1 2 and 3 will be held as follows so online application portal so on you can fill the form online and the dates are 15 3 2022 it means from the 15th march you can fill the form and last date is 16th february okay so you still have around uh, 20 days of time like maximum or around uh, like 18 19 days so you can fill the form if you are like fulfilling all the eligibility criteria for that then here you have few other information like how you can not just uh, like apply for this for the post multiple times multiple applications will be rejected so do not apply multiple times okay and then we have uh, okay, exam fees so for um for group b it will be 350 eb2 250 rupees for reserve candidates and if you do not have a reservation as per the tripura government you will not be able to uh, you will not be able to uh, consider it reserved so you have to fill the form as unreserved member then again entry in the examination hall with the jacket coat pullovers and these type of garments is not allowed apart from that you have to just check these things what are the uh, like different elements which is which should be avoided and which should be included yeah fine so this is all about the post of scientific officer government of tripura i hope we have covered the whole uh, notice in the next video we will discuss the syllabus okay so as i said we have different syllabus in different divisions but you will have one common section that that contains 60 marks so that common thing will be like same for all the aspirants if you are applying for chemistry division or biology or ballistics or anything it will be common in the other which contains 120 marks that will be 
subject specific and we will discuss the syllabus in the next video okay so see you guys in the next video have a great day ahead i hope you guys uh, like understood this whole notification and all that so thank you again see you guys in the next lecture till then bye take care